Hi, welcome to Tabletop 24 and welcome to another unboxing. Today we have First Martians Adventures on the Red Planet by Portal Games. First of all, it's got a heavy box, a lot in it, so let's get in. Okay, so straight up, the rule book front and center, as you might expect. So, nice, colorful pictures explaining how the rules work. And the summary and the player radar on the back. Here we have the player board. The main, main board in the middle, I was going to say. So we're going to lay out one of the, uh, the cards and the activities and map on Mars itself. Some of the campaigns. The campaign one, campaign two, some information in there. Set up how you're going to do it. The game is essentially app driven, so there'll be an app as well that you need to download to play the game. And this will basically help you to work alongside the app to get the objectives that you need to win the game. Here are some uh, gun envelopes uh, which are sealed, and so you only open those when you are instructed to do so by the app and by the game. We won't open them now, save any spoilers. And then we've got some of the um, information cards for some of the quests and adventures that you might be doing in the game. So punch boards. We have punch boards here for some of the uh, health effects you might have, some of the shutdown cards, some of the error effects on the machinery. And various other um, uh, tokens that you might need for power. Here we have um, some of the crew areas and the lab areas that are on the board. And more shutdown tokens, some equipment. This is where the power and oxygen are recorded. And then the individually these ones, you'll punch these out, and that's where you'll place uh, the markers, the cubes for tracking whether they're green or red. And here we have the uh, regions of interest, the ROIs that fit on the Mars. So they would essentially take one out here, fit on the board in these spaces there, as you uncover them, so we're adventuring. More punch cards, um, some uh, objective markers, some point of interest markers. These are morale tokens, first player token. And yeah, they're actually uh, named in here, so you can tell what they are if you got confused. These are the packing cubes for greenhouses, and the error alerts, and the seeds, for example. So these are just very typical plastic cubes. In here, got some of the some of the nice models as you rover. And the main base, it sits in the middle of the board. That's your home base. And another vehicle here, which is more of an industrial uh, support vehicle. Going into the dice, a lot of the events are controlled by dice rolls with different colours. So you can see there these sort of C3 dice uh, with different symbols on them, depending on what. Um, how they are. 
there's a few different types in there. Here's your player boards, your crew boards, and they've got punch boards here. This is where you place some of your um, health markers, for example. Space there to record your name and your rank if you wanted to uh, change that. And then these are one set of tokens. These are the um, uh, I guess action tokens, a place where you want to do your actions. There's a couple for each different color different players. And then we're getting to the the cards here. So So these are quite nice, they're quite reasonable um, thickness, got a nice satin feel to them. Uh, different colours on the back, so these are your malfunction systems. Um, the skill cards that go with your, um, your characters. And then these AOM cards which are um, automatic uh, machines that can help you. If you're playing with less than four players, you'll then pick one or more of these to support you. In the absence of uh, other players. And this one. Again, got malfunction blocks for the yellow regions, and more facility cards, and then some direction cards for when you're exploring, research cards. Try to get your research up to 100% is some of the missions, so these will help you get along that way. And upgrades. So again, they're all quite nice, very colourful. You can easily see what you're supposed to be doing with them. And finally, the red, red block. Again, uh, more malfunction cards uh, for the working block and the living block. Living block, and these basically are things that are going to cause you uh, complications, as it were, throughout the game to try to survive on Mars. Block itself has got a nice little pattern on the bottom just to make it take up white space and nothing underneath. So there we have it. Both Martians, Adventures in the Red Planet. Thank you very much. If you liked what you uh, saw here, please like and subscribe. Check out our other videos on the channel. We'll see you next time.